I'm gonna look at it backwards. I don't think that's the right yet. When I was here, I came in a different direction. That way was rough. <laughs> Glad we went around that. Well, it looked completely different coming back in the way I left. But I told you it was out here. Yep. It's weird because some of the way the land looks, a couple of those spots, you're like, that's a beautiful lift right there. Right. But that's all it really was, was just a lift. Right. Probably just a squirrel, they always sound massive. Yeah. <laughs> I, I've literally had one come through the woods while I was taking wildlife photos. It sounded just like a moose or a bear. It was big. I started panicking looking all around. And yeah. then there it was. I was like, Are you kidding me? Right. That much noise. From... A pound of fur coming at you. Yeah. bullet yeah it's a bullet well that's the usual first target yep or casing that day that I dug here there was um, barely any ammo right and everything was the classic late 1700s early 1800s so well, they could there's there's a vast area of land so I mean yeah but it wasn't what I'm saying it wasn't like ammo city right you just got lucky uh, hey, you know. <laughs> Big chunk of pot. Oh, nice that makes thing. that makes sense. Cool. Is that a knife or a yep. file? I think it's a knife. It's pretty flat. I think it'd be thicker if it were a file. Yep. Right off the very edge of the lip. Good. I moved a, a log and the signal came alive. Good. Old things. Nice, complete. I got a pewter button. Oh, beautiful. Yeah, mission accomplished. Right right at the edge of the chimney stack. I just dug a beautiful nail. Beautiful nail, good. <laughs> yeah, it's got stuff on it too, with shank. Nice. Which we know for pewters, sometimes tough. Gotta be chasing a shank. Wow, I was chasing a shank. Just shank huh? It's the center part of a pewter button, and you can just barely see the the two posts. No yeah. Wow. Well, I guess that's two buttons. Wow, and you know what? So. 
yeah I'm at the chimney stack you're at the front door right and the funny thing about this was is the signal was radiating from here but it was actually just barely under the dirt there oh. I must have just been catching the edge yeah. nice little lock mechanism yeah very good yeah it's cool I mean although you're near the front door it has a box like feel to it yeah it does I, I'm trying to figure out where the uh, unless that's snapped off I'm trying to figure out where the keyhole would have been well, unless that's, that's a, the back side that was in the box and oh else. right yeah and the other side affixed to it right that's probably what it is but still yep very good yep household item love it yep <laughs> Oh, nice. Tom back. Nice. Yeah, I thought it was a shotgun Willie was so loud. Okay. Wasn't deep. Oh, wow. Oh, beautiful. Nice shank. Buenos. Yeah. I dug the tom back, stood up, and promptly dug another button. Nice. And they're an inch under, so you might want to move migrate down to the front yard a little bit. All right. Wow, another one. That's that's three buttons within six square feet. You just take a button? Yeah. Yeah, another tom back. Yeah, everything's been that late 1700s stuff. Right. I don't think they were here long into the 1800s. I figured there was probably more stuff banned out, but. Yeah, so take this out. Like, this is all, this is all loose. I haven't even dug into it. Yep. Oh, look at the shank on that thing, eh? accomplished yeah there you go buddy very nice definitely so yeah like I was telling you I mean I wasn't here an hour and 15 minutes I wasn't right. here long because it was just a, one of those days but I didn't work down the front here very much obviously right <laughs> but I mean this could easily been masked by that shotgun Yep. I mean, I've had that happen before. That's why you go through, you dig some junk stuff, and you come back on a second pass, and you're like, oh, how did I miss that? Because it, like, uh, the metal ore cancels oh, yeah. out the other one. Yep. Good. Yeah, it's like, it, it, it's just all rocky. I mean, that's probably why nothing's deep. Right. Another one. Nice. Crazy. Yeah, the Tom back again. Wow. <laughs> Tin foil. Really? <laughs> yeah. Miles from pavement. Wow, that was deep. Yeah, for sure. Oh, you're not too far out. You're only feet away from where I dug all mine. Oh, look at that massive tomback. I know. Yeah, clean that baby. Yeah, give that thing a brush. So what's that, five buttons just down in this little zone? Yeah. 
And I'm still weaving between all these little trees, so there's probably more. Oh yeah, it's scattered up. It's definitely there. pinball. Wow. Up some of it. Once it dries up, it'll clean up a little better. But it's a beauty. Definitely. I finally got a shotgun and Willie. Oh, did you? Yeah. I can feel it. That's big. The other half of the door lock. Wouldn't that be crazy? I think it might be. The size and shape is right. Yep. Missing a piece. Yeah, I think that's what you get. Yep, I think you're right. Oh yeah, there's stuff in there. Oh, more tin foil. Yeah, loggers were definitely hanging out up here on the little hill. So at first I started out with this top to a bottle. Yeah. Old glass and stuff. And yeah. then then I got a really high pitched like a 79 to 82. Oh. So I was like, ooh, and it was really tight. It ended up being this that was folded. Beach life, main sardines. Oh, and soybean oil. Oh yeah, you gotta love that, right? <laughs> you, you, you can just taste it. <laughs> nice. It used to always seem to be the case we'd find sardine cans around logging. Yep. Messes. This yeah, usually I found the outer rim. Yeah. You know what I mean? I don't usually find the top. Yeah. But this can't be that old one wipe and it's pretty clean. You know? Nice. Oh, it is a button. That was weird. 79. That was a button at 79. Nice. Odd though. Yeah, it's almost uh, like a copper signal. Yeah, it could be copper button. Oh wow, I think I got shiny. I think I know what it is. It's not as old as you would think for out here. Right. But if you see where I am. The logging pass through. I am, I'm in the, it's the logging rut, but it's the, it's the pile up from the tires. Ooh. It looks like a dime. It is a dime. No, it's a barber. Is it really? Yep. Wow, I have not dug a barber dime or barber anything in a long, long time. Well, you got the goggles. 1902. Oh, wow. Logger, hunter, something. Passerby. That's right. Wow, I'm up two silvers for the year. Nice. That means nothing next year. <laughs> <laughs> That's all right. I mean, take they don't it. come around very often. Uh, what was it? Two, three years ago, I dug that mercury dime. I think that's the last silver. <laughs> yeah. It's all right. I'll take it forward. That's right. <laughs> nice. Date's nice and proud. You can see it. Oh yeah. That was not a banging signal either. I've had a couple of oddball stuff. Wow. Yeah, these people were probably out of here a hundred years before that. Oh yeah. Yeah, there might be more. That's there's definitely iron in their nail. Huh. 
Oh yeah, I just saw something. Wow. It's a wheat penny with it. Really? Yeah, I mean... Right, well you figure early 1900s it could be a wheat penny, were they 1908 or 9? 1909, so it's not far off, but right. still... It's still awesome, but... Definitely. I might need your uh, goggles to sure. get us a date. Looks like... almost looks like 1927. Wow. Well then, yeah, your barber could have been pulled. Right above my thumb you can barely see maybe a two and a seven. But sometimes that could be, you know, it could be something different. Right, well. Still, let's do the check. A 57. So I'm either going to get the nickel to go with the set or it's will. Thing. It's Willy. Ha! Huh. It is a nickel. Is it really? Yep. Huh. It's got to be a buffalo. It is a buffalo. Wow! Nice. What that a treat! It's going to be hard to get a date because a buffalo is wiped clean very easy. Yeah, maybe there's a quarter in here. Or larger. Let me check it again. 78, 79. Another weedy. Four coins. Rough on the date side, but definitely a weedy. Well, I hit it with the all metal with some extra depth. Yep. I, think, I think it's clean, but what do you got? Pork chop. Oh. 68, and it was pretty tight, so I was like, yeah, it could be an ammo shell or maybe a button. That's good, it's the first one out of here. Yep. Well, relic-wise, that was great. Oh, yeah. Coin spill, unexpected treat. Very unexpected, but still, you know, it's, it always has the same excitement, no matter what year the coins are or what type. You yeah, know? I'll take weedy excitement. I found myself kind of glued to watching what was coming out of the ground instead of swinging. Just because, you know, what what's in there? What's in there? Yeah. And with these cold mornings, eh. But it's finally nice enough to walk out in a t-shirt. You enjoy the jacket. Yeah, I will probably for one or two more episodes. <laughs>